Killer's got about 100 and I think 45 poachers on his name since since he's been used started been using in, in 2012. So he's he's very good, but he's also getting old now. He's about eight years old this year. So he's he's starting to be on that age that we're looking to retire him next year. We started in the Kruger National Park with dogs end of uh, 2011, beginning of 2012. Um, I would say the, the project is very successful. I, I would say up to date, 85% um, of all the rest and successes, the dogs are involved in and, uh, um, doing some of the rests. We have uh, 52 dogs in the Kruger National Park on the stage working right through the park. That is the gate detection dogs and all the dogs that's on, on the sections right through the park, the anti-poaching dogs. Uh, this is what we call a puppy line or a tracking leech. Uh, the dog will have it on and he, he will track with it, like this. We'll go over there. And a big essential part of our tracking in the Kruger National Park it's a tracking collar with a GPS so that if we lose a dog we can find it again. It happens that in the contact you will lose a dog and it runs off. So this is essential to have it so we can find them if they ran off. Our plan later on is to develop a um, training location where we do all our training. On this stage we get our dogs trained from service providers and we just do the, the maintenance and the transition from here. Um, what we're looking at is to get dogs and totally train them from here and, and make sure they, they trained on on the reserve.